Why is Elon Musk afraid of AI? Elon Musk, AI is dangerous than nukes. On March 14, 2023, the release of GPT-4 sparked both excitement and fear. This AI breakthrough boasted transformative capabilities, simultaneously raising concerns about unintended consequences. Fueling the fire, a paper by Microsoft claiming that GPT-4 exhibits artificial general intelligence, AGI, something experts thought to be decades away. If true, this revelation holds immense implications, as AGI could pose risks like economic disruption, job displacement, autonomous weapons, and power concentration. A tidal wave of skepticism and apprehension swept through the AI community, with tech CEOs, including Elon Musk, joining experts in signing a petition to halt further AI development until a regulatory body is established to govern AI. Has Sam Altman gone too far? Could this trigger an AI arms race? Is GPT-4 a danger to humanity? AGI is at a state where machines can learn, understand, and apply knowledge across various tasks at or beyond human capability. AGI has the potential to revolutionize industries by automating a wide range of tasks, leading to increased productivity and reduced costs. While this may drive economic growth, it could also create imbalances in wealth distribution as the benefits of AGI might disproportionately concentrate among a few stakeholders, such as tech companies, investors, or highly skilled workers. The top three industries that can have immediate impact are customer service representatives, the legal profession, or journalists and writers. Just look at this video. The AI answers this, and the person at the opposite end has no clue. This is not actually me. This is a voice made by computer. Oh my god, are you serious? Imagine what it can do on a customer service call, as there are billions of data that is available to train this AI. The customer service industry provides around 3 million jobs globally, with a value of around $350 billion. And just installing a trained AI can completely remove human needs in these jobs. Yes, transition needs to happen, but not this fast. Next, legal profession. It's a $85 billion industry globally. Most important thing in the legal field is to investigate and argue. Well, humans don't need to argue anymore. AI can do that. They can browse through millions of lines of judgment across centuries and present and the best argument. This would save a lot of time and deliver justice on time, but it would put 15 million people globally out of a job. Finally, yes, you guessed it, journalists and writers, a $250 billion industry with over 2 million people involved. With advanced AI, you can write any type of article with great precision. You can even mimic your favorite writer to design your article. You can write songs like Cardi B, plays like Shakespeare, journals, white papers, books, articles, almost everything within seconds. Other industries like tuition, coding, research, design, editing, VFX are all at high risk. Anything that involves writing or learning, analyzing, and reciprocating can be done with ease and precision. This would create a domino effect where industry after industry can be taken over by AI, which would result in chaos in the society joblessness, lack of responsibility, and it disrupts the order of the world. I mean, this is the order that we know. You go to school, then college, get a job, work for 30 years, have savings, and finally retirement. With AGI, we can directly go for retirement because most of the human jobs can be automated and taken care of. So what do we do then? Who is going to feed us? What kind of job are we going to do? What Elon Musk and other tech leaders are asking is that responsible question. Government should focus on these changes and take necessary action for transition of these jobs so that peace in the society is protected. With a lot of septua and octo generations as lawmakers, we have to agree that we are moving at a snail's pace in understanding the challenges posed by AI. In simple words, we need to have laws for AI transition. 
And frankly, we have no clue so far. Hypothetically speaking, if we solve the jobs issue, then it is really beneficial. It advances the human race to the next level, just like a calculator did. Yes, imagine doing calculations in mind without calculators. That would be a nightmare. So with a proper transition plan, AGI is good, right? Uh, no. This is where it gets uglier. So far, we've spoken about the goodness of AGI, with a few job losses, and how it can help us to be a better human race. But we also need to see the real dangers. So buckle up. From now on, it's going to get even more crazier. I just asked GPT-4 to list the dangers GPT-4 can pose to humanity. I thought it was going to skip, but it did respond, and it was scary. The number one thing, fake news. Fake news is common, but with AI, you can speed up the process and make it more convincing. This article is 100% fake, done using AI. Usually this would take days to edit an image like this and come up with a convincing article to match, but with the help of AI, it took just a few seconds to do that. In fact, Elon Musk is worried because he does run a news company called Twitter. He might have seen the spread of fake news in Twitter after this recent AI revolution. Just imagine the amount of convincing fake news that can be generated through AI. The possibilities are endless, and what if fake news is automated? That would be chaos. Constant fake news without any interval. AGI can also cause bias and discrimination. Language models like GPT-4 learn from vast amounts of text data, which often contain biases and discrimination present in the training data. Consequently, GPT-4 may inadvertently perpetuate or amplify these biases in its generated content. For example, a company uses GPT-4 to screen job applicants by analyzing their cover letters and resumes. The language model has been trained on historical data from various sources, including job postings and previous hiring decisions. Unbeknownst to the company, the training data contains biases against certain demographics, such as gender, race, caste, institution, or age. This can be huge because this might cause unfair hiring practices, which would result in loss of talent and diversity, legal ramifications for the hiring companies, and make erosion of public trust. Another problem with AI is that unintended consequences. For this video, I wanted to generate a thumbnail image that created curiosity and explains the necessity for AI pause. The plan is to show a tense-looking Elon Musk hitting a stop button. This is the command I used. Show worried Elon Musk hitting a industry emergency stop button, which is red in color. And look what I got. It did complete the task I asked, but totally misaligned from what I actually wanted. For a thumbnail, this is totally fine. It took me a lot of fine-tuning to get what I wanted. But imagine a similar scenario for some serious jobs. What if advanced AI is in the hands of immature humans? What if AI completely misunderstands your command and harms humans unintentionally? Totally possible. If you think this is bad so far, it's gonna be ever more badder going down. AI can trigger arms races between countries. Soon you can see countries fighting for supremacy. What started as an automation of work might trigger cybersecurity attacks. Or even worse, it might even be a cyborg attack. Yes, with AGI, robots might have the capacity to think, respond, and reciprocate. This might be a full-blown attack like the movie Terminator, a doomsday scenario. These are all speculation from AI experts and tech CEOs who have an understanding of the systems. GPT-4 itself has explained the dangers for its system. We had a similar tension during the 40s when nuclear capabilities were tested and it resulted in catastrophic consequences. Elon Musk explains that AGI might be worse than a nuclear crisis. 
So the possible solution is to take a pause, understand its capabilities, work on a transition, and give a solution that is both progressive and also responsible for the society. While we don't discourage development of any technology, in this case we recommend extreme caution, as we should know, progress is a double-edged sword.